from Matt M's Quilts and M's Scrap Bag and today I'm going to show you how to make an ironing board cover that you can put on top of a storage unit like you get at Ikea or Target. The reason I'm doing this is because people asked about my pressing station. I have a 36 by 36 cube. It has nine cubbies in it. Thanks for watching my video. Remember if you like it to like and subscribe. All right, let's get started. All right, what you're going to need for your pressing station is a shelving board and you're going to want real wood, not pressed wood or melamine. Just because with the heat, it's going to give off fumes, and I don't know how safe that is. If you feel good with that, go with it. But I prefer to use a solid wood board for that reason, because there are there's glues and stuff, and when you heat it and stuff, fumes come off. You're going to want some canvas fabric to cover the top of it. Um, and you just want it to be big enough to go over the sides, down, and like an inch in. So whatever your measurements are there. And then you're going to need some Insulite. So you can buy this at Joann's and I will put a link for it down below in the description. I'll also put a link for the kind of shelf that I use to put my pressing board on. But um, you can choose whatever kind of shelving works best for you. So what we're going to do first is take the Insulite. And we're going to place this on our board. We're going to flip our board over. Oh, you're going to need a staple gun. And I'm going to take my staple gun and I'm just going to start stapling this in place. On the corners, I'm going to kind of miter it, so I'm going to bring in the corner, do this side, and then this side, and then I can staple that. And you're just going to do that all the way around. Once we get the insole bright on, then we're just going to take our fabric that we've chosen to cover our board with. And we're going to do the same thing that we did with the insole bright. Alright, and then we're just going to set that on top of our shelving unit, and then you're good to go as a pressing station, and you have all the storage underneath. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time. Bye!